Okay guys, so the second fight I want to talk about uh, for this evening is, in my opinion, a very good fight. Uh, in the heavyweight division, Odlanier Celis going up against Tony Thompson. Um, you know, we know Thompson lost last time out um, uh, against uh, Cobra Pulev. And Odlanier Celis has the one loss on his record, which was when his knee went in the first round against the Klitschko brother. Um, you know, I'm expecting uh, this to be a good fight. I think we have two good heavyweight boxers in the ring here. Two guys who can can actually box. You know, I've said before, before before the price fight, I was saying Thompson is his toughest fight yet. Thompson knows what he's doing. Uh, he does sort of things in the ring. He's he's experienced. He's he does little moves. He's not an, an athlete. Okay, neither of these guys are athletes, but they do things in the ring. They 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 are boxing like they say is not a bodybuilding contest. It's about boxing, and their technique. Both of these guys, their technique is good. It's a good high-level technique. We should see some nice bo boxing in there. Um, I'm expecting Thompson to try and work behind the jab. He's going to be the one with the more length, I believe. It depends. You know, Solis comes in sometimes in terrible shape. I'm hoping Solis is in good shape. Um, I haven't seen uh, what he's been like. I haven't seen any footage of him running up to this fight, any pressers, anything. Uh, I'm just, you know putting that out there, look for what shape he's going to be in, or research what shape he's in, because that can have an effect on the guy. Um, we saw what happened to him against, uh, I think it was Vitaly Klitschko, when his knee gave way. You know, this this is what, what happens, excuse me, this is what happens when, you know, guys have too much weight on them, these things go wrong. But the thing is with Solis is that he is, he has a good amateur background, very good amateur background, in fact, and he's good technical boxer. You know, he take he's got a quite a unusual type of style because he takes punches on his gloves and he moves forward, walks forward to you, and he's able to take shots on the gloves. But he's kind of like an Arthur Abraham with head movement. Okay, so he's not just taking shots on the gloves and you're hitting him in the head. You know, so he's sort of taking half a shot here and there. He's got his head moving, and he but he's willing to sort of palm you off with his gloves as well. You know, he's. He's got that mobile sort of upper body movement that will allow him, I believe, to get closer and get punches on Thompson. Uh, you know, I think he can land on Thompson. I think he will have to use... You know, Solis is not slow. He's got a bit of speed in his hands. I'm expecting Solis to, you know, to really kind of use his speed to get the punches off in this fight. And I think he can cut the ring off, make it uncomfortable for Thompson, and really land some good quality shots. I'm expecting... Uh, well, I, I, I think... My thoughts on this are that Odlanier Solis is going to win by decision. Uh, that's that's my thoughts. You know, you can't write off Thompson because, like I said, he, like he said, he's experienced. He knows at the box. He's been in there with world level guys. He can come in with a game plan that can keep Solis at length. Can perhaps employ a couple of tricky tactics, a little sneaky maneuver here and there to kind of make Solis uncomfortable. Uh, he, if he's on his homework, you know, trying to make ways in which. To, to try and uh, wear out Solis to, to make him tired. Because, you know, if Solis comes in in bad condition, Thompson's going to be thinking, I want to take this fight down the stretch. I want to get him tired. I want to take him into the to tre to the trenches where he will get tired and I'll be able to land my, pun land my punches. And, you know, um, we we'll see what happens. Uh, I think, like I said, I'm expecting a good technical fight, some good heavyweight boxing, um, a good, it's a good competitive fight, I believe, but I'm expecting Solis to win by a decision. Okay, so they're my thoughts on that fight. Uh, please enjoy the fight this weekend, guys. Um, I know my, my thoughts are relatively brief, uh, but but you know I think I've got out there um, all I I wanted to say um, on that one. So thanks for watching.